Hello and welcome to Distant Learning in Room 112. Today's adventure, cooking. All right, so today we're making the veggie bowls that you learned about yesterday. Yesterday we sequenced the recipe together. Uh, today I'm actually going to do the recipe. You don't have to do this at home if you don't want to. Do not go to the store to buy these ingredients right now. If you have them at home, great. If not, follow along. When it comes to the evaluation at the end, you won't be able to write down how it tasted or if it was any good, but you could still tell me what tools we used and how we prepared the veggie bowls. So for the recipe today, you will need cucumber, celery, carrots, sour cream, and the recipe called for ranch dip, but I'm at my cottage and I don't have ranch, so we're going to use onion, onion soup mix, to make our recipe. It'll still work, it'll still be great. So, if you follow along on your recipe, step one says, wash the cucumbers. So, this cu cucumber I have washed, so it's ready to go. Now, I'm going to get my knife. Step two says, to cut the ends off of the cucumbers. So I have my knife, I'm going to carefully hold my cucumber and slice the end off of one end, turn that cucumber around, hold my knife again carefully and slice off the second end of the cucumber. In the procedure on the paper that you have, they show two cucumbers, but I only have one cucumber and that's okay. Step three, we have to cut this cucumber. How many pieces are we going to cut the cucumber into? Have a look at your recipe. Your recipe says to cut each cucumber into four pieces. So if I cut the cucumber in half, I have two pieces. And then if I cut each of those again, I will have quarters. I have four pieces of cucumber. So that's perfect. I'm going to stand all of my cucumbers up on their end. But they're not all the same height, are they? That's okay. Now, we have to use a small spoon. I'm using my little measuring spoon because it just looks so cute. It's perfect. And I'm going to use this to dig down into the cucumber to get out the seeds because the cucumber is going to become the bowl. Oh, it sounds very funny when I scoop it. I'm gonna come closer to you so maybe you can hear. Listen to this. Oh, there we go. Scooping out the cucumber seeds, making a little bowl. All right, there's two of our bowls. I'm going to continue scooping so that we have all four of our veggie bowls. There's three and now four. Now you may have heard some knocking a minute ago. That was my son. Because while you're all at home doing your distance learning, my kids are here too. So they always seem to need me, especially when it's time for me to do some work. Because to you guys, I'm Mrs. Poitra, but to them, I'm mom. And they always need mom for everything. So, now we have four cucumber bowls. Aren't those cute? These will make a great snack. So, next, we have to set these aside, because we're finished with those for now. We'll move them over there. And now the next step in your procedure is to get your sour cream. And then we open it. Now remember earlier I said I didn't have ranch, but I have onion. It's onion soup powder and it will be fine. This will be our replacement. So I'm going to open up my onion soup mix and I'm going to pour it into the sour cream. That's perfect. Now, 
It doesn't look very good right now, so I'm gonna stir it all together and make a nice dip. Ooh, that is a funny sound too. Ooh, it smells great. So there we have our, well, in my case, onion dip, even though your recipe says ranch. So that's perfect. All right, I'm gonna bring my cucumbers back over and a small scoop, and I'm gonna let that dip fall into the cucumber bowl. Oh, so cute. We're gonna put that dip inside the veggie bowl. Oh, that's excellent. Two more to go. So we'll put a little bit of dip in here. Oh, they're so cute. These will be a nice snack later and there won't be any dishes to clean up. That's the best part. No mess food. All right, so we've taken our dip and we have filled our veggie bowls. I'm gonna pick those cucumbers up and set those aside for now. The next step on your procedure says to open your carrots. Now I'm going to take out four carrots. We're going to put one carrot into each veggie bowl. Oh, how cute is that? This is so fun. That'll be nice on a, on a hot summer day, a perfect snack, and you'll all be able to make them. So we have our carrots in our veggie bowls. Now, if you look at your procedure, we need our celery. So I have my knife. I'm going to be very careful that I'm going to cut the ends off of my celery stalks. We'll set those aside. Now, oh goodness, I have three here. I only need two, so I'm gonna put one back over here. So we've cut one end off the celery. I'll cut the other end off as well. And then I'm going to cut the celery into strips. Being careful not to cut my fingers. Perfect. And I'm going to cut those celery strips into smaller servings, smaller bite-sized pieces. Now I'm gonna take my celery and put it into my veggie bowl. Oh, isn't that just so cute? Yes, very healthy. You've been talking a lot with Mr. Masseri, when he comes in for health, you've been talking a lot about vegetables. Here we have three perfect vegetables, our celery, our carrots, and our cucumber. The recipe is finished, except for everybody's favorite part. Tell me what your favorite part is. Eat! All right, so, cheers. Mmm.